My previous video on another mouse from Glorious with the same features has 860,000 views as of the time that I'm making this. Seeing as I'm a former Minecraft PvP YouTuber myself. Oh wait, I still am. Check out my second channel. It would make sense for me to put Minecraft PvP in this video, especially considering the main focus of the video that blew up is Minecraft. But don't worry, I'll also put other FPS games as well. I will have timestamps for that uh, in YouTube in the timeline. So don't you guys worry. But first, let's do an unboxing and get some of my thoughts on the mouse out of the way. The Model D- might just be the best mouse for people with butterfly click that exists today. Let's take a closer look. And if you don't know what butterfly clicking is, it's basically a method of clicking your mouse that makes you get really high CPS, which is uh, very important for some games. And there's this game called Minecraft. Maybe you've heard of it. And that is where this mouse shines the most. Basically, you make your mouse double click and the debounce time feature in the Model O software is what makes this mouse so great for doing that. You can make the mouse more and less likely to double click. And also, uh, smaller mice are easier to track with, uh, at least in my case and a lot of other people's cases. That is one of the reasons this is the best mouse for PvP because it's smaller and lighter than the previous mice from Glorious. PvP is all based on tracking. If you can get an advantage with tracking in any way, then it definitely helps. Their packaging seriously is very nice looking. And it says it has G-skates, very nice, so it should be gliding pretty well. And here's the bottom. Wow, Glorious really does a good job with their packaging. So last time I got a white Model O and that was my that was my first mouse from uh, Glorious. That looks awesome. This looks amazing. And I also am right handed so fits my hand perfectly. It glides so much better than my G Pro Wireless. I believe the scroll wheel is different from the Model O and I actually like this a lot more. This feels really nice. The classic honeycomb shell body the model d minus is 61 grams and the g pro wireless is 80 grams unfortunately this one does have a wire which as i've said i don't like wired mice after using the after using the g pro wireless um i just stopped using wired mice they come with additional mouse gates as well that is super awesome yo and it's just included that's great that's super awesome little sticker oh another sticker also includes a quick start guide cool I'm pretty sure the box is bigger than the model O box even though the model O is a bigger mouse so I think they've been focusing on their packaging experience a lot okay guys so uh, let's hop in the games